today's video, everybody. We are here for Drift Matsuri. The chase is low on compression. Will it last 36 hours of non-stop drifting? I just dropped the fuse that I blew. Here it is. I don't know, but we're off to a great start. It's, we started driving 50 minutes ago. I've been driving Nishi Long, having a good time. We just popped a fuse. It seems that uh, my battery terminal was a little loose. And when that's like constantly like connecting and disconnecting, it overloads the charging fuse. So uh, we're gonna go get a new fuse from the shed and then get back out there and start shredding. I put some like pretty grippy old Zestinos on, 265s that came on the front of my FD S15, and we were throwing the biggest backwards entries. It was gnar, man. So much fun. Anyways, we're gonna, we're, we're out of tires. We're already down six pairs. Sorry, six tires. Three pairs. So we're gonna go change and put some fresh ones on and uh, come back and do some more shredding. Maybe we'll go to Toge next or I don't know, whatever I'm feeling like. Nishi course now and what would normally be Nishi trains but there's literally like five or six people on track. I don't think I've ever been to a Matsuri where it's been this quiet. Literally summer Matsuri is normally the quietest one just because everyone's like oh it's too hot but the weather is so perfect it's like a crisp 17, 18 degrees non-stop so this is epic but also there's a bunch of drift events on at the same time so that's why there's like a lack of drivers but it's also a good thing for us because it means we get to practice more but I don't know, it kind of takes out the gnarly like adrenaline fun of like maybe Hello? crashing every time you go out on Nishi. Yes, Twitch chat, I'm giving you attention, calm down. All right. Hello there. Twitch just wants to let you know that they're more important than you guys, but we all know it's actually you guys. You guys are the real, the real OGs. All right, let's go out. <laughs>
my favorite part of drift material, and that's drifting at night time. It's currently 9 o'clock, 9 p.m., and we are at North Fork. And the drifting doesn't stop. This is all through the night. I love it. It's a little sketchy. It's dark, but the lights are all lit up. Plus, we've got some lights in the front of the chaser, so we're gonna go out and have some fun and shred. All the way up front. Oh. He's spin. Oh, they overtake and he goes. Mm. Oh, no, it looked like the, the middle car avoided it, but Sam couldn't see it, maybe. <laughs> Those tandems were getting gnarly. We should have known to like chill for a bit, but we kept going. <laughs> Unfortunately, Coda, I think, ran out of tire and spun out in the lead. And instead of like spinning out and going backwards, I guess he was shot forwards and it went straight into my wall, like my wheel, while I was transitioning. So it was the full like pen pendulum effect of the chaser going smack into his car. <laughs> like the hooning videos always have. Yeah. It'll be all right. How did your door handle fall off? Is it off? No. I'm just <laughs> it's no. It looks great for what you know what happened. Yeah. Dude, caught my wheel hard. He, he, my wheel literally went straight into his like whole front end. It, just, it would have been funny if oh. the whole door just fell off. Oh, that's fine. My wheel. Oh, dude, look at his car like chopped up the tire. Wow. Oh, shit. Dude, my. Oh, wow. Yeah, that's got some Damn. crazy. Damn. Someone did the same thing to me. Yeah. Look at this in here, real quick. You're so, breaking the car, Samir. I think the top arm's probably bent, but I'll check it tomorrow. But definitely something's a little whack. I mean, it copped the full brunt of Coda's car, so. Toe hooks bent too. No, that's been bent from when he fucking backed it in. I had to make it match. <laughs> He's just a bad driver, guys. I think Come the on. upper arm, the upper arm might be tweaked, but I can't tell until tomorrow and I jack this thing up. But so he spun. And it sucks when you crash into your friend's car. And honestly, I don't think there was anything we could have done in this situation. Coder, are you okay? I'm okay. You're fine. My car is not. Yeah. <laughs> I'm just glad you're okay. But hopefully we'll be able to get this fixed because he's got to drive this thing home tomorrow. <laughs> Yikes. But um, what happened? Did you just run out of tire and spin out? Probably. Yeah. Oh, that sucks. Because yeah. he just missed you. And then yeah. all of a sudden, he goes through there. And I'm like, why is Coda there? <laughs> <laughs> it was just nothing I could have done. That's the risk of three oh, <laughs> So we were three stacking tandems in fog at North Course at night time. Still overcast, not too hot. The best summer material in existence. It's Nishi Long right now, and I want some practice. So we're gonna take the chase around. I'm gonna take some uh, passenger, uh, do some passenger laps with some friends and stuff. But yeah, we're just gonna have a good time, do some laps, and then after that, I want to go see how Coda's doing after last night's crash, and hopefully he's got it back together, and we can do some more laps.
Are your cars fixed? Yeah. It looks as good as new. Yeah, you can tell. Drive all right, alignment okay? No problem? Uh, no, I need to adjust because the frame bent, so gas did change. Oh, okay. Just a little though? Yeah, so it was rubbing. I, right. I dropped the issue already. Oh, yeah? But overall, like, not too bad? Yeah. weekend yet so might as well do it on the last day my goal is to drive every track here today before four o'clock and I want to make sure I spend the last hour and a half at least at Nishi doing trains with everyone so we're gonna head out on Toge have a bit of fun see how fast we can drive it and just have a really good time and uh, hopefully not end up upside down that would be good
Higashi and we burnt another set of tires at Higashi. When you drive and link the whole track at Higashi, you burn through tires so fast. But it's time to have some fun at Nishi. I really just want to keep driving here so I can work on my chase tactics and really follow the line in front. So that's my biggest weakness with Formula Drift. And that's my goal to this weekend was to just get as much seat time as possible and try to chase as much as I can. So we're going to go back out there and have some fun. with this guy here a lot of fun then his rear bumper caught on fire from the exhaust and uh, I don't know if we have footage of it but yeah quick acting we put it out we're all good it started spreading so fast so I'm glad we we're able to put it out S13 fuel tanks are like right there but uh, yeah Chase is going great I'm having a lot of fun chasing behind this because he's low horsepower and I'm learning to like keep with the same line um, which is what I need to learn with uh, FD and stuff so I'd say today's going for a pretty good success rate so far. I just got this wasn't my car on fire. I'm so scared of fires. That's why you always have a fire extinguisher in your car, guys. But not only your car, but your friends' cars. We were rubbing doors for a fair bit. You can see these pink paints on my wheel. Nice little kiss. That's cool.
Well, that's a wrap. We made new friends. There's like hardly any of my foreigner friends here, so I just drove with all the Japanese locals and it was amazing. Seriously, we made new friends with this guy in the pink 180. We would trade in door marks all day. Honestly, best summer material I've ever had. So good. It is now the end of Drift Mitsuri, and that also means the end of this video. And I'm now at the front of my hotel, the sun's starting to come down, and I cannot wait to jump in the onsen, and get all my muscles reset and feeling good for, uh, I guess, tomorrow's drive back home. But guys, I hope you enjoyed today's video. Tell me what was your favorite part of this video. And um, man, I just, I just have to say, like, everything went flawlessly. We had a few accidents here and there, a little bit of a fire and stuff like that, but I'm not calling Steve saying, help, my car's broken. You need to fix it. So I think that's a win. Anyways, once again, I hope you enjoyed today's video. Smash that like button, rise the comment, subscribe. Also, massive thank you to each and every one of you that joined me on the live stream. And I'll see you on the next one. Peace out. Jamata.